you can flip past. We're here for another quick uh, episode. We're going to hear now talk about a couple sets coming out, guys. Um, we have Ash Radiance. We're going to put that on hold for a moment. And we do have the next special set, which comes out July 1st, Canada Day, Pokemon Go. Now, guys, there's many products for this. Um, we're going to just go over them one by one. Uh, there's no booster boxes in special sets, so we're going to keep that off the list, guys. Uh, I hope everybody's having a great Thursday night. Long weekend's coming, uh, Victoria Day. Uh, one more day of work, yes, for the Monday to Friday workers. Anyways, there's no booster boxes in special sets, guys. So we're going to start with the Elite Trainer Box. Now, as always, there's two options. There's a Pokemon Center exclusive, and there's the normal one. Now, both have Mewtwo on the front. Fan favorite, Mewtwo. He's the best, in my opinion, anyways. Might be biased towards Mewtwo. Anyways, guys, so the Pokemon Center exclusive one, it comes with two extra packs as usual. So, special sets, you get 10 packs in a normal ETB opposed to 8. So, you get 12 in the Pokemon Center exclusive uh, Pokemon Go ETB. Uh, in both ETBs, you do get a Mewtwo promo card. Uh, if I was great with computers, I'd be like, it's right up there, you know, picture. But not that tech savvy, unfortunately, guys. But, uh, as always... Pokemon Center exclusive ones, they're definitely worth holding, guys. Uh, the little bit of history and data we have, it shows that uh, it just goes up. Uh, the first set was Chilling Rain, so it wasn't too long ago. It was a little over a year ago, year and a half, I think, roughly, when Pokemon Center exclusive ETBs came out. So, the Pokemon Center exclusive, I wouldn't open, but I definitely recommend getting one for your sealed collection. Uh, if you're a sealed collector, I know there's some people, some of my buddies, they cannot, not, and I repeat, not keep any sealed because they open it all. Um, what I say about the original ETB, if you want to open, that's a great buy. Uh, you get 10 packs um, here in Canada. Um, they're probably going to be about $64.99 roughly. Um, 10 packs, can't go wrong because you can't uh, get a booster box. So if you want to open anything, ETB is what you're looking at, the Pokemon Center exclusive, hold on to those, I don't really see why you'd open it, you just get two packs more, <clears throat> excuse me, and you, um, you get a little deck box, like, you know, and you get a promo, mute, same promo Mewtwo in both boxes, so, stay away from the Pokemon Center exclusive, if you want to open, get the normal ETV if you want to open. On to the next one, guys, this one is by far the one I'm the most excited about, there is a Radiant Eevee collection box. Now, it comes with a beautiful, shiny Eevee promo card, and you get eight packs. And you also get an Eevee playmat. Of course, I wish I could put pictures up in the video so uh, you know what I'm talking about. We just have to go and look for that Radiant Eevee. Uh, I think it's premium collection box. Uh, that one, honestly, uh, you can open or keep sealed because you get eight packs, and it's pretty good. I think it's... Uh, relatively the same price as the ETB, so you're looking at about 60, 65 bucks for the box. Um, but that, to me, I'm going to open one of those. I'm going to open an ETB, and I'm going to open one of those Radiant Collection EV ones. I'm not going to get one to hold, probably. The only thing I'm probably going to hold, guys, are the Pokemon Center exclusive ETBs. Um, I do have faith in Pokemon Go set, but I just want to feel out and see how it goes, because there is big question marks here. Uh, I do think this it will be a pivotable, pivotable, pivotal set in the Pokemon TCG, knowing the success of Pokemon Go and how it pretty much single-handedly in 2016 just blew up the TCG and got Pokemon back rolling and where it should be. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, that Radiant Collection, uh, the mat alone is beautiful, and you get the card in eight packs. Um, we're going to go to... <clears throat> Ooh, I'm gonna take a drink, guys. We're gonna go to we're gonna go to the three trainer boxes now. Not elite trainer boxes, the trainer boxes. So they're like boxes uh, for each um, each gym trainer in the uh, game. Basically, you pick three teams in Pokemon Go: Instinct, Valor, and Mystic. And each one's gonna have its own box. It comes with four packs and it comes with a promo full art card of the leader of each team in that game. So you got Spark, Blanche, and I'm not bring part in the last one, um, the Valor team leader, the evil team in Pokemon Go. Stay away from Red, folks. But no real talk. 
those full art cards are nice. You know, it depends how much the fat you want to go into the set, how big. Um, you If you have a more disposable income, um, hold one of each of those boxes for sure. Um, personally, I'm going to be going hard for the Charizard, Blastoise, and Ven Venusaur Radiant, Collect Radiant cards. So, I'd probably open one of them, one of each. And I'm on the fence about that. I'm not going to keep those sealed because if I'm opening for those cards, then I just can't justify getting two of each of those boxes. But you do get four of each. They're about 45 bucks. A little less than the Leech Hunter box, but you only have four packs. And you do get that nice, the full arts are nice, guys. Uh, I wish I could put a picture up, but uh, you're just going to have to go on the internet and check for yourself. So there's three of those boxes. Um, they're about 40, 40 bucks each. Uh, they'll cost you, so uh, move down this list. We do have tins. Tins, guys. Who doesn't like tins? These are about 35 bucks. Um, 30, 35 bucks. You have four packs, and you get a, a promo card. Now, there's three different ones for the normal size tins. There's the Pikachu, Snorlax, and Blissey. And uh, I personally, I'm a big, uh, I'm a big Snorlax fan, and uh, I like Pikachu. Obviously, who doesn't like Pikachu? Uh, those would be the ones of choice. Blissey, I'm not. Not really sold on the Blissey much, but uh, I would, um, if you want to open some packs for like just 35 bucks, it's nice, but typically I stay away from uh, the tins. If you want the cards, uh, probably just buy the cards individually, guys. It's, uh, can't go wrong with that. Sorry about moving the camera around. I'm holding this phone up the whole time, and my one hand's getting tired, so I had to switch there. Um, yet again, we do have mini tins coming as well for this set. Uh, you do get a coin and three packs. Um, I don't know if all of them are going to be Pokemon Go packs. Or you're going to get two Pokemon Go packs and then a random pack. Uh, you get at least two Pokemon Go packs, maybe three. But you get three packs in total, and those are about 20, 15, 20 bucks. Um, but guys, the best bang for your buck is probably like percentage wise would be that um radiant collection you get eight packs and it's like you know 15 bucks 20 bucks cheaper than the <coughs> excuse me then the etv the radiant uh, ev is about 50 bucks so it's about 15 bucks cheaper and you do only get two less packs than an etv so you get eight of them so plus you get a play mat i don't know if you have like play mats it's actually good to uh, handle cards on the play mat just totally protects the card gives it a soft surface so if you're looking for just best bang of your buck for opening packs it's the it's the, e, the radiant box so uh i would have totally look into getting that if you want to open uh, like i said i'm going to open uh, an etv and one of those radiant ev boxes and then maybe one of each of those gym the team leader boxes we'll call them so uh yeah um i'm pretty sure that's everything that's announced as of now um but there, there, there is always, you know, a couple more products to get released or announced once the set comes out. So that's the Pokemon Go TCG news, guys. There's going to be about five, six products on shelf. The set comes out Canada Day, July 1st. Uh, it's going to be a very, very exciting set, guys. And Astral Radiance next Friday. So a week tomorrow, we will get Astral Radiance. Uh, a next set... Whew, with character rares and trainer gallery, it promises to be nice, guys. Um, we're gonna just uh, we're getting spoiled here in the summer of 2022 with Pokemon products and two new sets. It's gonna be nice. But uh, without further ado, Poke Palace, I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna get off. I'm gonna try and uh, post a video about Astral Radiance this weekend. I am tired. It's about 3 a.m. when I'm making this video. Uh, I think I'm ready for bed, guys. But uh. Appreciate you all. Please hit the like button if you like this content. Smash the subscribe button if you really like it. Uh, we're going to have a Astral Radiance giveaway. Um, probably, probably in June, early June. And then we're going to have a Crimson Invasion ETV the last day of school, which will be June 24th, I believe, this week. So we are going to have an Astral Radiance. The booster box opening next Friday, but the ETB will be the following week. We'll pull eight packs, and we'll give those to a, a lucky viewer. And uh, then we're going to do Crimson Invasion the last day of school this year. We're going to open that Crimson Invasion ETB behind, right there, waiting to be opened. We're going to open that and give away the hits inside there end of June. So we're going to have two giveaways in the month of June, guys. Two. Just because we, 
We love you here at Pokey Palace. But yeah, Pokey Palace, thanks a lot. Have a wonderful night and have a wonderful long weekend. We'll be back real soon. Stay Pokemon. Love, peace, chicken grease.